three people on. Good morning guys, welcome back to the Arctic Vet YouTube channel. My name is Trevor and today we're just going to dive right on in. It is a beautiful Sunday and I honestly after just reading my devotional and posting it on my Instagram story, I couldn't feel much more. I couldn't feel any better about today. Like I just, everything is just gone. So right off the bat here, last week last week was really really hard for me and again it, it's all because of these grabs that the the devil's trying to he's trying to drag me down he's been trying to drag me down he knows he knows that he's losing he's losing his grip on me and that's that's great that's amazing and honestly i feel like that that grip is completely gone right now so anyhow, last week I just, I was struggling a lot with being way too overstressed, way too stressed. And that, that led to me feeling depressed and it's not a great feeling, but you know what? We all deal with, maybe not all of us, but most of us deal with depression. Most of us deal with stress and we, we all have outlets and you know, my outlet used to be, well, I'm just gonna go get my Corvette and I'm just gonna go drive. And now I don't, now that I sold that, I don't feel the same way about Dora as, as I did with the Corvette. And to, to be completely honest with you, when I start feeling that way, the first thing that I do is I start praying. I turn to God. I turn to God now. And that doing so has become my outlet. And so here's here's the really weird thing that, that happened yesterday. And uh, that's when I really started to feel kind of the weight lift off of my shoulders, so to say. And what happened is, so first off, we had I had a little surprise. One of my brothers came to town and it, I'm just, I'm so, I'm so happy. It's, it's been so long since I've seen him. And I, I love that he come up and seen us. <laughs> and I'm crying now. <laughs> but he came up to surprise us. And he, he, I really hate it, but he, he seen me struggle. He, 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 seen, he seen the depression. He seen the stress. And he's like hey bro let's let's go let's go uh i want to go do something and so as a family we all went to uh to see some of our our late grandparents and grandmas and grandpas and so when we went when we went to see them it in the cemetery when we went to see them there I went in and this entire time that he's been here I'm trying to like not let the stress and not let the depression get to me I'm trying to just have a good time keep looking at the positives and I'm struggling I'm struggling hard and so we go there and I, I'm still feeling very stressed very depressed and we, we go see them we go see all their all the headstones and we go visit them and while I'm there, uh, I just, I'm kind of quiet around them because I like to, I like to talk, talk to them through, through God. I like to pray. And so that's what I do. That's what I did. And as we were leaving, I just, and I'm, I mean, literally as we're like pulling out of out of the cemetery I just feel this huge huge relief this like sigh of relief I was just like holy cow 
I, I feel like every family member that I have there was looking down and just said, you know what, God sent us today, Trevor, give that here. That's how I felt. That is how I felt. And it, it, it blew my mind because I, I don't remember ever having anything like that happen. So immediately, I just, I started feeling a little better and feeling a little less weight, a little less stressed, a little less depressed. Well, then tonight, last night, I go home. You know, I go home alone. And I, it, it really gets to me. It really does get to me when I have to go home alone and there's there's nobody there. And anyhow, um, I just went home and I prayed. I prayed. <laughs> and I prayed that I wanted the Lord to fill my entire body, my entire body, my heart, my soul, my mind with his presence, with his love, with his everything, with his grace. Because I know that this time of loneliness has a reason. And one day will come where I don't have this loneliness. So this morning I wake up and I read my devotional, which I mentioned earlier, I posted on my Instagram story, and I actually typed this one all out. And so I typed this one all out, and uh, <laughs> I, uh, so I typed it all out. I just pulled up at my mom's though. I typed it all out on here, and I'll just go ahead and read it real quick. Don't mind me just fumbling through it though. It says, This is the day that I have made. Rejoice and be glad in it. Begin the day oh begin the day with open hands of faith, ready to receive all that I am pouring into this brief portion of life. Be careful not to complain about anything, even the weather, since I am the author of your circumstances. That right there made me laugh because every morning the boys and I pray, Lord, thank you for thank you for this beautiful day. Even though it's cloudy, even though it's foggy, even though it's rainy, even though it's cold, we still we still pray about that. Good morning. Good morning. Hi, Bobby. Hang on a second. Let me finish this. The best way to handle unwanted situations is to thank me for them. This act of faith frees you from resentment and frees me wow. to work my ways into the situation so that good emerges from it. To find joy in this day, you must live within its boundaries. I knew what I was doing when I divided time into 24 hour segments. I understand human frailty and I know that you can bear the weight of only one day at a time. Don't worry about tomorrow or get stuck in the past. There is abundant life in my presence today. So with that, I just, I was blown away. Here, come here, Easton. Come here. Come here, baby. Come here, baby. Hi, baby. So this is my baby cousin, Easton. Hi, baby. So anyhow, I wanted you guys to, I wanted you to hear that because that really spoke out to me today. Hi, baby. Hi. Hi, you smell good. No. Oh. What? No. You want me to get out? I think we're going to get out. We're going to have us some family time now. <laughs> you want out? You want out? No? <laughs> Anyhow, I love you all. God bless you all. For click that, Please click that red subscribe button. Don't forget to drop some comments down below. Let me know what you think. And smash that like button. Now go out there and on today. Don't worry about tomorrow. And don't get stuck in the past. God bless y'all.